Good morning and uh, welcome. Uh, there's not much of a video this morning. Sorry folks, but uh, there isn't. Uh, basically, um, sorry, but there isn't this morning. Uh, this is the uh, let's go to camera four. Uh, this is the black box amp. Uh, this is the black box amplifier um, it's all back together and the reason why it's all back together and it's all set or ready to play put the camera on top of it we can see the deck the reason why it's all settled to play is because the uh, I pulled all the transistors out to test them. Uh, the amp didn't work as we all know. I pulled all the transistors out and the diode to test it, test everything. And when I put it back together, it just worked. Um, just seemed to work. So. <coughs> I've tried tapping the board and everything to stop it working and it won't so there must have been a dry joint and I must have got it when I pulled it on one of the transistors more than likely on the transistor that comes off the volume control because there was no volume but there again there was 10 but there again there was uh, there was 10 volts missing off a transistor as well so You know, um, we've got it all connected, got a speaker on it there, got a motor, and it's switched on. So let's get a record. We'll put it back together later on. Um, I need to find the screws for it because I've misplaced them. We've got them somewhere. I've put them away. I can't bloody remember where I put them. I'll put them in this drawer, am I? No. I've put them somewhere. I can't remember exactly where. But they're in here somewhere. They're not in that one. Uh, anyway, I managed to find a new Ronette stylus for this. Uh, we've got a new stylus in it. It's playing absolutely beautifully. Uh, so what we'll do, we'll That's about as best as I can get it. I'll do. Tone works and everything. Without a rotary action like the Billy Shave. Twist nothing down and tilt like exploding heads. Unique Billy Shave. Twist here, twist there, twist just yeah. like exploding heads. Floating, floating heads caress your face. Like the softest head. whiskers go yeah. without a trace. But this personal touch is so unique. Only Billy Shave. It's made for every face by a new technique. 
folks works absolutely perfectly and there's no hum when you turn the volume but there's no hum or hiss out of that at all it's really really smooth it's nice really really good and I'm really happy with it it's just a shame that there actually wasn't. It's just a shame that a fault didn't crop up that I could tell you what was wrong. You know? <coughs> but that being said, you know, now and again we get one of them conditions where that happens. We get a problem where there's no fault. Well, there's a fault, but we don't manage to do it on camera. Um, because uh, sometimes, I, sometimes I obviously work off camera. And, uh, you know, like, you don't want to watch me boringly test transistors. Uh, everybody in this game knows how to test a transistor. <laughs> you don't want me to you know uh, boringly show you how to do that so i thought last night i'll do it off camera uh get it to uh, get get everything tested and then show you what i've gone through and see if we have any luck and you know see <sighs> Because with that ten volts being missing off that transistor, I thought the uh, I thought the driver was knackered or something. But obviously not. And the two outputs, I retested those with the transistor checker with new battery in it, and uh, uh, they came up perfect with a new battery in it. So. Um, you know that was uh, that was it really. You know, just a shame I can't show you. Yeah, just a shame I never had a definite fault. Uh, I just think I think it was a dry joint. Uh, that's all I can put it down to. I can't put it down to anything else. It has to be a dry joint. Um, hmm. I'd love to try and remember where I put the damn screws uh, because now it needs to go into its record player kit now it needs to go back into its cabinet so but yeah we're all working and it's uh, working lovely I'm going to leave it there and uh <coughs> see, I get it's only it's only about half past eight in the morning or something. I'm gonna make myself a cup of coffee, 
get myself showered and changed and ready for the day, changed and showered and changed ready for the day. And uh, see if I can remember where the hell I put them damn screws. I thought I'd put them inside the amp. And uh, I'm sure, sure I put them inside the amp and they fell onto the floor with the rest of the shit that's down there. But uh, I'm, I'm having a tidy up in here later, so I'll find them then. They'll be here somewhere. Uh, thank you for watching, folks, and I'll catch you later. Just sorry, I'm just really disappointed there wasn't a definite fault we could talk about, but it must have been a dry joint on one of them transistors because I didn't touch any resistors, capacitors, apart from the electrolytics I replaced. Uh, but I tried it. I tried it after replacing the electrolytics before doing anything else, and it still didn't work. <clears throat> I can assure you of that, it still didn't work. And I took each transistor out, tested it, put it back. It works, so we're going to leave it at that. Uh, thank you very much, folks. I'll catch you later. Bye for now. Oh, by the way, if you, uh, if you like what you see, then... Uh, like, share and subscribe. Bye for now.